Good evening and welcome to our 9 p.m. English news brought to you live by RTD. My name is Anna Farah. President C. Eid al Adha donation, the head of state granted calls to the orphan. Kenyan Moy School High School, seven girls killed in Kenya school dominated fire. And now the national news. On the occasion of Eid al Adha, the prisoner of the commune of Balbala, Mr. Wabar al Nuh Aleya, surrounded by the local elected representative of Balbala and advice of neighbor to organize in the evening of Thursday, 28 August 2017, within the commune of Balbala, an award ceremony distribution of clothes granted by the President of the Republic, His Excellency Ismail Omar Gili, for the orphan and children of family the most deprived in the commune of Balbala. In this occasion was present at the partner of personality of Balbala, namely between others President of Commune of Balbala, Mr. Abdullahi Ainan and Yusuf Hassan, as well as the member of Balbala, Mr. Mahdi Momin Abdi, Mr. Noor Warsama Mire, Mr. Abbas Chama, the Federal Secretary of the Party, RPP of Palbala. It is the final in the force of Choi of the song claiming uh, Vive EOG, Vive Our President. That is close the evening of all the more that the children accompanied by their parents are divided, all delighted and proud to their gifts. Uh, and this is the interview that we had with uh, Mr. Wabere Elmi Eleye, which is uh, presenting these uh, children of the most deprived family, the gift that the Mr. Ismail Omar Gele has given to them. After the prayer of the morning of the official reception at the presidency and visit among families of the opportunity of the Eid al-Adha, yesterday in the day at the time, the evening was devoted to young people who are out in the various arterial road of the capital. The majority of young people were working on the road to Venice. Some also spent pleasant time at the edge of the water, at the center of the capital and the commercial district. Young people held it in the restaurant to eat or to take, the, take away their dinner. On the occasion of Eid al-Adha, the street of the capital, especially the house as well as the runabout, the shop were bright color and multicolor as well. The festivity of Eid al-Adha was observed yesterday evening a little everywhere in the Republic, like the region of the interior of Djibouti, has always been able to celebrate the festivity of the great Muslim feast on the wave of the radio and television of Djibouti, indeed broadcasting live from the premises of the RTD, a great musical evening was held in the presence of the responsible officer of the institute and was animated by the national artist Yang Talento, national artist and by the group called uh, Generation EOG who have made a great impression to the public present to the television viewer for the four corners of the country in presenting folkloric dance and traditional dances. This great evening of the musical animation was complete success and held the awakening the faithful viewer of the radio and television of Djibouti until late in the night. It was as well as the day of the Eid of the faithful Muslim Djiboutian is completed in the joy with good and great atmosphere.
In the region of Dikil, Eid al-Kabir was celebrating the fate of the mercy and joy of the showering. Lifted early in the morning, drops in the new clothes, the Dikil was men and women and children have covered toward the place of prayer of Madatu for the prayer of the morning, surrounded all the prayer active in the region of Dikil. The elected civilian authority, military religious, the prefect of Mr. Muhammad Sheko was participating praying in the morning led by Sheikh Hussein Abbas, the faithful repeated the heart of the takbir of Uluma and the Imams, as well as the tradition many families in Dikil have made the choice to sacrifice a small ruin of cow or a camel for the riches. The first meat is consumed by the family, the second neighbors and the third to the poor. A Turkey NGO has granted 500 ships to sacrifice for the benefit of population of Dikil, the city of Yuboki, and other under the perfect of the region of the unity. In this occasion, the prefect of Dikil, surrounded by the president of the council, Mr. Abdurrahman Yunis, and the authority of the region, has transmitted to the participants, consisting of all the regional authority, and the message of forgiveness, compassion, and tolerance, solidarity, and harmony between the population, the region of the unity, that gathering all the nation communities. He also addresses best, his best wishes to the population of the region of the unity and Djibouti around the world. Now in the region of Obok, prayer and the ceremony of the Feast of Eid al-Adha took place also in the faith of joy, small children, early in the morning. The faithful are rounded in the mask at the prayer and the Eid which, Eid which has been put together all the population of the city of Obok on the place of 27 June in front of the city hall of Obok. The prayer of the Eid was headed by the Sheikh Mahmoud Omar in the presence of the prefecture Hassan Abali and the president of the regional council of Obok, Hamad Ismail, the head of the state of major of the region of Obok, Colonel Adam Duali, and the authority, the officers of the police and the gendarmerie. After the prayer of the traditional reception was held at the prefecture of Obok, gathering all the actors said, the representative of the population, it was also time of forgiveness and sharing for the participant. The prefect of Obok, Mr. Hassan Dabali, had wishes to the entire population, to the president and the first lady, the opportunity to this feast, which is one of the most important of Islamic festival. Ad, in the other region of the country, the Eid al-Adha was celebrated yesterday in Ali Sabih. There were numerous faithful Muslims in this city, men and women in the community of the heart of the man to coverage in the early morning of Friday 1st September in the mosque, Jama Noor, of the city of Ali Sabih principal place of the prayer built for this occasion. Uh, the prefect of the region of Ali Sabih, Mr. Muhammad Wabari Azawi, accompanied by the minister of the region, minister of labor, Mr. Hassan Idris Samire, requested with hundreds of loyal to the cost of the president of the regional council, Omar Ahmed Wa'ais, and the honorable member, 
عمر علي وعيس After the prayer, the Prefect of the region, Mr. Muhammad Wabere Azoe, has received his guests to the traditional reception at his residence in order to share with them a meal accompanied by cake and pasty. Several uh, personalities to the various profile has been taken in this reception, including the Minister of the region, Hassan Idris Samira, the President of the Regional Council, Umar Ahmed, the Honorable Member, many friends, as well as the customary religion chief of the region of Ali Sebiye. After this moment, the conversality of the prefect of the region of Ali Sebiye, Mr. Muhammad Wabri Asso, wishes happiness, prosperity, health, at the president of the Republic, His Excellency Ismail Umar Gale, the first lady Khadr Muhammad Haid, as well as the whole Djiboutian population. <laughs> The ceremony of this Eid al-Kabir in Ali Sabir saw the participation of the Minister of the Region and the Minister of the Labour, Mr. Hassan Idris Samir. The Minister of Labour, Mr. Hassan Idris Samir, has addressed his best wishes for the happiness and the health prosperity to the President of the Republic, Ismail Omar Gale, and First Lady, Madam Khadra Mohammed Haid, also addresses his best wishes and happiness to the whole region of Djibouti. The Eid al-Kabir was celebrated yesterday at the Chora. The faithful rented in the mosque toward the mosque of Masala to perform the collective prayer of these days of Eid al-Adha. In addition to the prefect by interim Habib Jilani, regional council Umar Hussein, and Lieutenant Colonel Ali Shehim, the head of ATA of the Tajora, as well as the various authority. After the traditional prayer classes for young people with the children excellent in the dance of Aura, the young children of SOS village of the Chora was celebrating as well as other young people in the interior of the White City. After the prayer, a large reception official was organized at the prefecture of the Chora. The prefecture by interim, Habib Jilami has received participants who share a great breakfast, follow up the sitting of the greeting to forgive themselves while wishing the health and prosperity toward each other. In the region of Arta, the faithful of coverage early toward the side of the prayer of the feast of Eid al-Kabir, early in the morning, the population of Arta, which enjoy a pleasant climate in altitude, is made a mass for participating in the prayer of the Eid, which has brought it together all the Djibouti in the capital and in the region of the interior. The Prefect of Arta, Mr. Abdullah Darar, and the President of the Council, Ilmi Buh, and the Authority of the Region have participated together at the prayer with a strong participation with the Artawis. <laughs> On the occasion of the feast, Eid al Adha, Bank Salam Africa, the one al Islam, has distributed this morning at the headquarters of the one donation 
to the meat, to the benefit of the family's claim of fire of Balbala relocated to Kotit Barwako, this donation was distributed to a vulnerable family in the large suburb of Balbala. This donation is intended for the family claims and relocated to Nassim disaster fire and relocated to the project of foundation right housing accommodated the private family distribution of the meat was placed this morning at the site of Dewan Zaka of Balabala. After the ceremony of distribution of the meat for the benefit of the families relocated to Nassim and other needed family in Balabala, the representative of Salam Africa Bank, Mr. Abdullah, has expressed that this gift of meat is intended to relieve this family taking part in continuous to the road traced by the President of the Republic, His Excellency Ismail Mergele, with his unwavering support to the family of the disaster. This day, on the 2nd of September 2017, to eight hours, a tragedy road traffic accident took place on the road from La Casal, not far from subdivision of Almumina. It is a vehicle of marked Toyota Prado carrying four young women and two men who <coughs> the private was reserved, reversed at the president the ramp of the La Casal toward the Jora. The deprived not having been able to negotiate to turn has lost control and has carried out several tons before coming to a stop on the four wheels. As soon as the gendarmerie of the brigade of Arta and those of Lac Asal intervened have alerted the ambulance to Arta and Lac Asal, the rescue of the victim. This accident has caused, caused the life of three young women and also made three other serious injury. During any operation, the regulation has been ensured by the gendarme of the Brigade of Arta. The high commander of the gendarmerie reminds motorists that excessive speed is the main cause of fatal accident occurring our road outside the urban area. In this sense, it is requested to user to comply with the permissive speed of 80 km per hour in order to preserve their life and others on the road. And now let us move on to regional news. In Kenya, where seven students have died and dozen other injuries after a fire burned down a dormitory of Moy Girls School in Nairobi. For more detail, listen to Saeed Mohammed, please. School dormitory in the Kenyan capital Nairobi this morning, killing at least seven teenage girls. Ten more girls were taken into the investigation. This is not the first time a fire caused casualties in Kenyan boarding schools. In 2001, 58 boys died in Kwanguli Secondary School, and in 2012, a fire claimed eight lives at a school in western Kenya. In Tanzania now, with the collaboration of United Nations are moving ahead with a plan to repatriate thousands of Burundi's refugees to their homeland. It is coming after the Burundi's government declared country secure. But the UN warns that human rights atrocities are still going on. For more details, Said Mohammed plays. Tanzanian government is urging the United Nations Refugee Agency to quickly repatriate thousands of Burundian refugees who it says want to return home. Homs First Minister Wingulu Nkema said on Friday that over 8,000 refugees are pushing to be returned after they registered for voluntary repatriation. UNHCR in Tanzania did not respond to a request for comment. In July, Tanzanian President John Mangifilo suspended the registration and naturalization of thousands of Burundian refugees. Over 240,000 announced his ultimate successful bid for a third term. Protests that the move was unconstitutional turned violent. After the BRICS summit will begin in a few days, South Africa President Jacob Zuma arrived in East China Exman city 
on this morning to attend meeting of the 9th BRICS summit scheduled from Sunday to Tuesday. More detail with Sayyid Mohammed, please. South Africa President Jacob Zuma arrived this morning in China Xiamen City to attend meeting of the nine BRICS summit scheduled from Sunday to Tuesday. Leaders of other BRICS countries will arrive in Xiamen for the summit. The theme of this year's summit is a stronger partnership for a brighter future. China will host the largest ever BRICS business forum from Sunday afternoon to Monday morning. President Xi Jinping will attend the opening ceremony of the business forum and deliver a keynote speech. On the sidelines, the dialogue between emerging market economies and developing countries will be held under the theme of promoting mutually beneficial cooperation for a common development. That's all for this evening news. Thank you for watching us and have a wonderful evening.